Welcome back to Bird Fruit. Here we go again. I'm Kira. I'm Charlie. And we're gonna swap these hives. Swap those hives. Clear that junk. Okay, what is this again? Is it just not gonna tell us? Mystery item. Why do all of these have the same dorky symbol on them? Boys, you swear. Uh, Joey, I hate to tell you this, but you're wearing a short with a shirt with a dorky symbol on it. I really hate to be the one Call to report that to you. Call out post. Call out post. Guess this? It's big. Okay. Oh. Goodbye, it's Debris. Crush. Just drop it in the hole. <laughs> yes. If the, if the Tetrarch Lucius is upset, it might have got Tex hurt. No? Oh, got ten. Hussy, I swear oh, to God. Oh, oh my God. Zephyrus, you sweet angel, please. Please. Oh, got X? Already figured it out, Joey. We don't need to have this part of the conversation. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, got ten. <laughs> That's cute! Anyway, I did see a whole lot of blood smeared up to a huge hole in the floor. Oh no. Oh no, it's Deer Cat's blood. I'm glad it wasn't another troll's, because I hate murder in his own home. Troll murder? Well, it was brown, so it's pretty old. <laughs> I'm Baby. not sure what you mean. The Tetrarch is a bronze blood. So that's either Damic or his Lucius, and it's recent. Wait. Okay, you've been saying things about blood color a lot, but I've been assuming it was metaphorical. Are you saying members of your species literally have different colors of blood? Yeah, I'm a rust blood. Bronze, rust, so it's a metals thing? No, it's my color. I'm actually a burgundy blood, but... But maybe this isn't the best time to talk about all this. Yeah, I'll be glad to tell you all about the blood on our planet when I'm not leaking so much of it onto the ground. <laughs> right. Wow, I really thought I'd be dead by now. No, oh, baby, no. Don't worry, I'm coming as soon as I figure a way past this wild beast. Maybe I can give him a treat. I do have some pet treats. What's a pet? <laughs> <laughs> Trolls are too much for me. <laughs> uh, I think it would be a little weird if I described it to you, given the fact that you were, it sounds like, raised by one. <laughs> Smile? Question mark? Let's move on. Maybe I can sneak past him. Pretty unlikely. Wait, are you the kind of alien that's invisible and silent? No. <laughs> yeah, no chance then. Maybe I can outrun him. I'm surprised he's been chasing you. That's really not like him. Well, now that you mention it, he didn't exactly chase me. I think this might all be a misunderstanding. Mm -hmm. He's probably upset with Damic missing and everything that's happened before you got here. I mean, they can be kind of frustrating. Lucius says, I mean. They mean well, and they try to take care of you, but they don't always know what they're doing. And it's not easy to understand them, you know? Yeah. I have someone like that. Oh? 
Yeah, my babysitter. You'd love her. Her name has an X in it. <laughs> oh, okay. Well... Okay, if we have an upset beast on our hands, there's really only one thing to do. Yeah? Joey Claire, amateur veterinarian, is going pro. <laughs> oh. <laughs> BRB. Time to go pro. Go pro. This guy really More is a good kid. God, go home, emo boy. This is literally like a Borderlands game. <sighs> hey, now you can get down to the bedroom. Neat. Descend. This looks like some kind of safe, you guess? Hard to be sure, given your current surroundings, but it seems to fit the usual profile. Damn, it seems pretty paranoid. Even if you could crack the safe, it probably wouldn't be um, safe to do so. But, um... Oh my god, I didn't even <laughs> hate it. Joey, no. I'm too busy reading it. <laughs> <laughs> Just a typical air vent, previously repurposed as a human vent, but it mostly deals in air. <laughs> Steer clear. Well,. All right, best case scenario, this grotesque sack of goo is some sort of alien bathtub that someone forgot to drain. Worst case scenario, it's an extremely poisonous toilet. Look at that I read last time. Or the time before. Okay, <laughs> I can't gross. remember if we've been in this room before. Yeah. Okay, we've read that, I remember. This is where we got our beast book. I think we can go through the left door. Didn't we just we open it in here? I don't think so. Oh, okay. Now we're in the room with the Lucius again, I think. Hey, There's Tom. our buddy. What type of friend are you? He is so cute. The I deer cat him. is in the way. Enjoying the loosest milk you placed earlier. The plan is really coming together, except for the part where you almost brushed past to get to the kitchen. That would probably startle the heck out of him. Upon closer inspection, this animal is clearly hurt. It's time to put the resources you've gathered to their proper purpose. Okay. Knowing Homestuck puzzles, it's not going to be the most obvious. Thing that we have, which is bad. Yeah. I guess that we have to read about this thing first. Gotta learn about baby boy. We flip through the pages. Let's see here. Oh, here we go. Its scientific name is apparently the Cuspidated Grimmelkin. <laughs> the Cuspidated Grimmelkin is a chimerical union of predator and prey with the strength of Long, retractable claws and razor-sharp teeth alongside a defensive crown of stabbing horns. The speed for lightning-quick dashes and the endurance to run entire nights without tiring. Proud and resplendent, cuspidated grimalkin prefer to bond with bronze-blooded wigglers in whom they sense a strong natural aptitude for leadership or bad friendship. Such aspiration and low bloods are grounds for culling, of course, and the primary cause of death for cuspidated grimalkin is in defense of their treasonous wards. Wow. Anecdotal account. Yeah, he's like, please let's not both die because you're a bad boy. 
The anecdotal accounts suggest that those cuspidate the Grimalkin who manage to survive the death of their wards will typically seek out a similarly orphan troll and attempt to bond with them, although the selection process is naturally rather mysterious due to its staggering illegality. So... The Grimalkin needs to get together with Pepperoni and raise Zephyrus together as a couple. Yes, that, but also if Damic dies, maybe it'll choose Joey. Perfect. Several anatomical diagrams are included. From these, you think you'll be able to treat the deer cat, which is why you're gonna keep calling it for now. Caspidated Grimalkin is a bit of a mouthful. Okay, I think now we're ready for this. Let's cure this baby. Or not. Baby. Oh, sweetheart, how did this happen? Oh! oh yes, be friends. Yes. yes, adopt Joey as your own. Yes, give me. Oh, wow, what a cutie, but what's his name? You could have Zephyrus, you guess. But you feel like there's something between the two of you now. Something that merits a new one. Your time to shine, Charlie. Cornabuster. Well, I hate that. that. Please change it. Okay, well, if pepperoni is named after a pizza topping, then this one should be named after a pizza topping. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> you do love arugula. I love arugula. That's so cute. I want to be friends what with an him. <gasps> Ride him! Okay, Arugula seems to be doing better, and so are you. You helped out an animal. An alien animal. This is a pretty big win for you, so you're riding high, despite the bizarre and frightening circumstances. Ride Arugula. And speaking of riding... Ride Arugula. Ride Arugula. Ride Arugula. Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm suddenly pretty nervous about how I'm going to get over there. I keep seeing the shadows of huge, hulking things flying around outside. Yeah, the crossing won't be easy. I'm sorry. Is it always this hard to get across the street? No. I mean, not usually. Things have gotten pretty... intense. Oh my god. <laughs> How do you mean? Someone we were supposed to be meeting with didn't show. Or maybe they did, and it all went bad. I really don't know. Damick didn't tell me what was happening. And I screwed everything up. I know it. You did nothing wrong, Zephyros. You should stay there. I don't want you to risk getting hurt because of me. You were gonna risk it for me? Yeah, that's true, I guess. No guessing necessary. I didn't realize then how brave you were being. Thank you. It means... <laughs> it means a lot. But... No buts. Except yours. <laughs> Which I'm saving. Are you sure? Extremely. Oh. Yay. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my, oh my god. We'll be there in a flash. And Joey always knows exactly what to say when she's not freaking out because she's... she's been moved onto an alien planet. I know. She's a good egg. Good egg. Excellent. Yes. Wait, we? <laughs> Ride, arugula, arugula, and ride, Joey. arugula, ride, arugula. This is so good. I love this. Oh my god, the Lucius is there. He just doesn't know what to do. Hey, we're here. Oh jeez, is that you under the rubble? I mean, I assume it is. I hope so. Not that I want you to be getting crushed under rubble. 
I hope it didn't happen enough that I mistake you for someone else being crushed under rubble. No, it's me. I was lucky. Lucky? Left for dead, covered up, but not hurt badly enough to actually die. The ones who got cold on sight, or snatched up to be cold later, probably in some sick high blood spectacle, weren't as lucky as me. Is this what you're rebelling against? These drone things? No. I mean, not really. The heiress is in charge, and the drones obey her. It's her birthright. So why is she doing this? I have no idea. Globalists get cold for anything and everything, or for no reason at all. She doesn't have to have one. Or maybe our subgrub being on fire makes a really sick selfie background. Are you serious? She sounds terrible. Yeah, no kidding. It's like the Tetrarch says. The slow, the soft, the unlucky, the troublemakers. Anyone who doesn't jump when the heiress snaps her webby little fingers. They get rounded up and slaved or slaughtered. Especially rustbloods. Like me! This is terrible! Your neighborhood is on fire! You're buried in rubble! Like you said, this is why we're rebelling. We were rebelling. This is so awful. Why hasn't someone already put a stop to this? My subgrub is full of low bloods. We don't matter. So no one cares. So nobody who does matter cares. All this is... is taking out the garbage. It's always been this way. Nobody does anything about it. Especially not gutter bloods. Like me. We're mostly good at lying down to die. Baby. But you're rebelling, right? So you are doing something. Oh, that's not me. That's the Tetrarch. Tetrarch Damic is different. He's amazing. I wish you could meet him. He always does things. Like, he's in a movie where he's the star, you know? Um... He put the whole thing together. The Rebel Network, the plan, all of it. But without him, we don't have a chance. He was the one who... He was the one everyone talked to, and now he's gone. He's gone, and I'm alone. And I'm slow and soft and stupid. And I'm just a nothing little gutter blood nobody. The biggest no. No! What? This damn it guy. He sounds like he stinks! What? Okay, I'm sorry, but you talk about him constantly, and not a single word you've said doesn't make him sound like an awful bully. No. It's not like that at all. He's just looking out for me. Ugh, open your eyes! Why do you think you're really saying these terrible things? It's not like I don't know where you're coming from. Sometimes my PA makes me feel just rotten. Sorry, I keep forgetting it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Not and I think, show. am I? <laughs> am I the reason he's never around? What's wrong with me that makes my own father not want to see me? But that's a load of garbage. The only person responsible for the terrible things he does is him. That's right, Joey. That's absolutely right. You um, tell it. You don't understand. Me and Tetrarch have been together since we were grubs. We were fated to be more else. You wouldn't get it because you're an alien. I need him. No, you don't! I may not know anything about the social customs of this crazy alien planet, but I know that a real friend would never stand by and let you think and say those things about yourself. I don't think you're nothing. In fact, I know you're not nothing. You've got plenty of your own bravery. Just because fighting back was his idea doesn't mean it didn't take courage to see it through. And you were going to risk everything to save me, an alien you'd never even met. I've ever heard get tried. Do you really think so? Yeah! I believe in you, Zephros! Oh, you remembered my name this time. Yes! 
that's because you made such a big impression on me and were such good friends and I'd be really sad if you gave up and died here under these rocks. Oh man, that actually means a lot to me. I never even dreamed like some, that something like this could happen for someone like me. Zephyros, I'm going to do my absolute best to raise your standard of friendship to the point where having your name remembered is not the nicest thing anyone has ever done for you. I'm not alone after all. I've got Jolly Alien here to save me. And tell me what to do. Well, uh, haha, <laughs> no! We're in this together! Oh yeah, right. Thanks, Joey. Now, let's get you out of there, and then figure out what's next. Are you sure you don't know anyone who can help us? I kind of don't even know what kind of help we need, but it seems we do. Well, I do know someone. But they don't exactly live nearby. It'll be a journey. Are you sure they'll help us? Yeah, she hates the heiress. And she's our biggest fan. That's good enough for me! Now hold still, I'm gonna get you out of there. Oh, You've got no chance of moving all that with just your bare hands. It's time to bust out the hover pad. Or maybe it was the hover sled. You can't quite remember. <laughs> well, you guys better remember because it's time to stay fruity. No, I bet this is the end. Charlie, no. This is like the last thing. Please. If it's any longer than this, it'll be hard to export it. No, do it. <laughs> Please. Fine. <laughs> baby. Oh, no, baby. I'm sorry I laughed at you. You look so silly. Look at Worry these friends. Babies. Oh, he's holding her jacket. He blushed. Everyone's by. <laughs> See, Charlie, what if we had ended the video there? It would have been so sad. <laughs> <laughs> what if this cut seems like five minutes long? You'll regret that. It will. Well, that's the thumbnail. <laughs> Do we get to see her? Oh, we don't really get to see her, though, do we? Oh, we do, yes! Hey, beautiful, evil baby. Big, beautiful, and evil. That was that. That was the hive swaps. Kansas City Shuffle. What? <laughs> what? What? <gasps> oh, why, why was it called that? I feel like preyed upon. <laughs> Look at the right side. I again. That pigeon lived. I don't even care. The, all the pigeons are currently mm. still alive. That's my head. All head those head. pigeons are alive. Bye, Damic. Bye. I hope They're... Jude tells you off. Honestly. Ooh. I love this. I love pepperoni. I hope Pepperoni, Pepperoni really went on the good. journey with him. Please come. Pepperoni. Even though I bet he did not, because he's a sleepy, lazy baby. <laughs> Friendship. Oh! Arugula. I think what I like about our naming schism is that you don't even like Pepperoni. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't like Pepperoni on pizza, but it is a real cute name. <laughs> but you love Arugula on pizza. I love Arugula. <laughs> Oh my god, she has a nail art Instagram. <laughs> That's great. Very canon. Shelby Craig. I used to follow her. Yeah, same. Maybe I still do. 
It's a mystery. We did it! We did it! We finished the first one. This will maybe be an extra special long video. Yay! Yeah, it's already 25 minutes. Yay! Yay. <laughs> I'm so proud. It's really good at the end here. That's good. Well. Hey, look, you helped make this possible. Is hey, is your name uh, on here? It will be, but it'll be the the correct one. Well, that's okay. Well, actually, that wasn't everyone that backed the game for sure. So actually, not. Yeah, I was like, that was not very many names. Well, I thought. Did you I... have to pay like a certain amount? I thought I backed the the credits tier, but maybe I didn't. You dropped some cash. I did, unfortunately. <laughs> well, stay fruity for real, everybody. Yeah. New game on the horizon. That's right. Get ready for a new game. Bye. Bye.